You got it. You rolling? Okay. Hey everyone, Jace out here in fabulous Las Vegas, and here's what's happening this, this week, week in, in gambling. gambling. This Week in Gambling has been made possible by SBR Forum. Sports betting discussions and handicapping on all major sports leagues. Visit them at sbrforum.com. Hello, my friends, and welcome to This Week in Gambling. I'm your host, Jay Todd, coming to you from our secret studio somewhere near the White Sands Nuclear Testing Facilities. Yeah, I'm told it's perfectly safe to be here. Huh. Seriously though, I had to shoot the show in advance this week because I'm traveling. I'm somewhere over the Atlantic right now, unless there's been a catastrophic mechanical failure, traveling to the iGaming Super Show in Dublin, Ireland. There, I hope to accumulate a lot of great interviews with interesting people that I can come back home and bestow upon you. Speaking of great interviews, how many of you out there have ever played a game called Slingo? Show of hands, anyone, anyone? You, sir, really? Now, I personally have not had an opportunity to play the game because my job demands about 90 hours a week and quite frankly, I just don't have the time but I sure get a hell of a lot of requests for it every week through my Facebook friends, so I'm guessing it's popular for a reason. Well, yours truly caught up with Rich Roberts, the CEO of Slingo, a few weeks back, and I thought perhaps you guys would like to meet the man and hear what he had to say. Hey everyone, I'm here at the Gigsy event in San Francisco. I've caught up with Rich Roberts, the CEO of Slingo. If you're a player out there and you don't know about Slingo, listen up. Rich, first of all, thank you so much for coming on the camera here and speaking to our audience. Can you tell people who may not know, maybe the two or three of them that are out there, uh, what is Slingo? So Slingo is a game made of slots and bingo. Uh, we've been around for about 15 years now and started off on AOL back in the day. And uh, we had about 16 million people playing. Many of your customers, your audience probably has played Slingo. And we've also been on many other platforms, including slot machines in the casinos, uh, on mobile, on uh, you know, Android, iOS platforms, as well as you've seen us on Scratch Tickets and many other platforms out there. Wow, okay. Um, so you've been around for a while. Uh, you're an established brand. And yet, in today's environment of uh, social gaming and online gaming coming on strong, Slingo isn't resting on its laurels. It's making some big strides, some big moves. You guys have had some major announcements recently. Would you like to enlighten them? Sure, yes. Uh, just recently, last 60 days, we launched uh, Zynga Slingo into the uh, Facebook channel. Uh, we were working with our partner Zynga, who has taken Slingo to the next level. Uh, better graphics, increased gameplay, a lot of exciting new things about Slingo. So if you haven't seen Slingo before, it's a good time to go check it out now. Where can they find it? On Facebook? Just go on Facebook and uh, just type in Zynga Slingo and you'll find all the new creative features around the game and look for some exciting new things down the road. Thank you so much, Rich. I appreciate Thank you coming you. on the show. Take care. Stay where you are. We'll be right back with more This Week in Gambling. Subscribe to our YouTube channel and get our latest videos as soon as they're published. Visit youtube.com slash this week in gambling. All right.
right? I'm not fooling anyone, I know. Players, did you know that we have made it very easy to interact with us? Send us feedback, tell us stories you think we should be covering. Tell us we suck if you want to. First of all, you could follow us on Twitter and get updates on breaking news stories several times a day throughout the week without having to wait for this video to come out. Get over to twitter.com slash twigfeed if you're interested. Also, our Facebook fan page rocks. Not because it's about us having fans, but because it's about you, our fans. There we list the same news stories that we do on Twitter, but we also discuss them and listen to your feedback, maybe even put it on the show. So if you're interested in that, try facebook.com slash thisweekingambling. What a great name. All right, sports bettors, we haven't forgotten about you. Here's the man who insists upon not wearing any pants while he's filming. I do. <laughs> Peter Loshak from SBR Forums. Thanks so much for watching. I will see you next week from the floor of the iGaming Super Show in Dublin, Ireland. Right now, I've got to go get ready for the trip. I have to pack, make sure my passport is in order, drink a pint of Guinness, drink another pint of Guinness, drink some Irish cream and another pint of Guinness. It's Ireland. I'm Irish. I got to prepare. I don't want to be embarrassed in front of my kinfolk. So, uh, what is, uh, what is a uh, robot like you doing out here? Oh, just hanging around looking for uh, other machinery, if you know what I mean. <laughs> so you're you're a transformer. I am. Yeah, I am the original one, from, uh, Las Vegas' first generation one transformer. Let me ask you this: I've always been curious about transformers. Yeah. Are you pre-op or post-op? <laughs> wow. I guess we're uh, as as Alpha Trion made us. <laughs> That doesn't tell me if you have any junk down there or not. Oh, we do have a lot of junk. <laughs>